Very good morning, my friends. How are you? Hope you guys are doing very well and welcome on this new deal of the day video from Extreme Trader. This is Salah speaking. So actually this week we were planning to start buying the gold, but however, the price action which is happening has changed the whole outcome or the whole plan. Now, I think if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, the gold is better for the short. Uh, let me show you. If we go to the daily chart, uh, let me go to the better one. Uh, daily chart right here now if i'm not mistaken on daily chart we can see that the gold has actually respected this resistance trend line and the pair has reversed multiple times on the same resistance trend line and eventually the gold is going down all the way to 1700 this is going to be our next target for the gold so therefore this week or uh, this day and hopefully maybe the next week we are still going to be going to short the gold so if i'm not mistaken also look at that uh, I have sent also the, the signal on the midweek analysis video that we can start buying the gold exactly from the level of 1721 and this is exactly what happened the gold has reversed exactly from where I have mentioned and currently running if you have placed your buy order it is running right now in 62 pips of profit but however if I'm not mistaken it's time to change the signal. Now let me show you this. Since I this okay, let's, let's go here. Now since that we have seen here that the gold is moving on this trend line, resistance trend line, and respecting it. And right now, if we draw right here a horizontal resistance, we can see that the market actually has respected this resistance multiple times. Exactly right here on 1,733. We can see that the pair has actually made an attempt to break out from that level and failed. And right here also and what we can see right here happened of course multiple times here as well but what we can see here happened was a fake breakout the market has made not even not just once but two attempts of uh, to break out from that level of 1733 now after seeing these two fake breakouts if I'm not mistaken the gold now is gonna be good for the short and let's now move to the 30 minute time frame so we can tell exactly where we can start shorting the gold now if we look right here we can see that right here we had a previous support level this is best level actually because here we can see that we had a strong support level uh, it was also a support right here and that support level has been respected again as we can see right here but immediately the market has made a strong bearish breakout and as we can see right here we had here two candles representing the resistance number one or the first attempt of the resistance and therefore we can expect from the gold to continue the rise all the way until it hit exactly the same level of the resistance and create resistance number two this is exactly where we can start again shorting the gold and also it's going to be respecting our uh, resistance trend line that being said uh, deal of the day is going to be about shorting the gold, sell gold on 1732. Let me say 30. 1732.30. Now, of course, regarding the stop loss, the stop loss has to be right here above the resistance level. If the candle has rose, re the candle has rose actually above that resistance level. Uh, let me just make it uh, more. Uh, yes, that's better that's better not there is no need to make it higher than that so the stop loss has to be about 100 pips so this is going to be our stop loss 1742.58 and of course regarding the take profit level the take profit level is going to be right here the lowest level of the support exactly right here so we are actually aiming about uh, 137 pips hopefully gonna be in a good profit so the tech profit level is gonna be 1718.88 now a question here happening uh, uh, somebody might ask, ask me ask me a question why is your risk to reward ratio is almost 50 50 50 i mean the stop loss is just almost the same as the tech profit level the answer is today is friday and the market is gonna close today of course so therefore um we cannot really make higher or we cannot make the take profit level more than that guys because i mean i i really hate to keep the trades running till the next week so this stop loss right here is only is, is gonna be triggered in the worst scenarios and honestly speaking i don't see this is happening in my opinion gold is gonna be good for the short and it's falling the gold is falling for sure and th that's my opinion and therefore we are actually going to be aiming the take profit level more than the stop loss. The stop loss is there just to stop the bleeding. I mean, if in case you, I have to say something. 
you are a trader and you are investing so if you are entering the deal of the day you should be investing an amount for example three hundred dollars that's gonna be your stop loss that stop loss has to be equivalent to three hundred dollars and the profit has to be about four hundred or more the idea is you are investing so you decide okay i'm going to enter this trade and i'm not worrying about wiping my account because i have invested 300 dollars in this deal and i'm ready to lose it in hope for gaining these profits this is the trader th mental thinking sh how it should be actually you should be considering that each and every trade you're opening is an investment don't think, oh my God, this, this trade is going to wipe my account. Oh my God, uh, I'm going to enter this trade and I'm going to double my account. That's not going to work at all. I'm sending you the deal of the day for a reason. And it's helping you to grow your account. So therefore, if you are blowing your account uh, and the signal hits stop loss, then what was the point of the deal of the, deal of the day, right? You have to be always careful about how you are funding, uh, managing your fund. Sorry. You always have to be considering that the trade might go in loss. But however, as I said before, the stop loss right there is only to stop the bleeding. Let's all focus, guys, on the take profit level, because in my opinion, this is exactly where the gold is going to. Sorry, I have made a long, I have made a long speech, but however, I just want everyone uh, to be profitable in Forex and hopefully will achieve their dreams. So uh, hopefully this signal is going to work very well and hopefully it's going to bring us lots of profits. So in the end, I hope that was informative to you and I would like to thank you for watching.